guys, welcome back to Brit's Craziness. My name is Brit, and welcome to my craziness. Alrighty guys, y'all been waiting for this fall decor um, haul for probably two weeks now, so it's about time that I deliver. Um, I do apologize for the delay, I just wanted to make sure that I had enough stuff to show you guys so it wasn't short video, that it was long enough that you would actually have uh, been waiting for a good, good video. Um, but first, Let's, um, I'll tell you first off where I went, where my husband went, and what we all found. So, where I went was Saturday. We went to Home Goods, uh, went to Marshalls, went to Target, and went to Walmart. So, at Home Goods, I found some things. At Marshalls, not Marshalls, Michaels, I do apologize. At Michaels, I found some things, but I just wasn't sure, so I just didn't get anything there. And then at Target, didn't find anything that I wanted because they didn't have too many fall decors. And then they didn't, I mean, the only thing they had out was candles, really. So, I wasn't, uh, I, only, I only got one candle this whole time um, on Saturday. And so, just, uh, I just wasn't, I didn't need another candle. Um, and then at Walmart, I found a ton of stuff. But first, let me show you where my husband went. He went to Dollar General Market first, and let's show you what I got from the dollars. Dollar General Market, Dollar Tree, and Family Dollar. All right, at Dollar General Market, my husband found me this pillow, and it says Hello Fall, and it has the red truck that I like. I like the red ones, I like the blue ones. I'm not biased on any colors. Um, I just like the trucks, and I think they're super adorable. So I had some trucks last year for Christmas, and he found it this year for fall, so he found me this. <laughs> Sorry, my one-year-old is trying to have a conversation. Um, he bought me this pillow, um, and I think it was like eight dollars at Dollar General Market at the most. Moving on, stop <laughs> to the Dollar uh, Family Dollar. So we found some rugs there. We didn't find too many things at the Family Dollar. I don't think too many people are uh, putting out their stuff just quite yet, but I did find these two rugs. This one I found for my front door, and I just feel like I just feel like it uh, matches the pumpkins match my pumpkins outside. So I just thought the front door would look super cute with it, um, and so this was only five bucks. I think the most expensive thing in this haul was probably fifteen bucks at the most. Um, my bouquet that I made from my Walmart stuff that I will show you in a few seconds, um, that probably cost a total, <laughs> a total of $20 at the most. Um, but yes, let's move on to the next rug that we found at D Family Dollar. And this one says Happy Harvest, and I just love the pinks and the orange, and I thought it went really well with my kitchen decor. So I got this one for right by my stove. And that too was only five dollars. Moving on to the Dollar Tree, my husband found me this sign, and it looks like a mason jar. <sighs> Kids, I love them. It looks like a mason jar, and um, it also has the red truck, and it's also fall, and it also has my burlap. I love burlap, I love fall. I love the red truck, I love the pumpkins, I just love it all. Comment below if you like the red truck. If you're gonna decorate with the red truck this year or the blue truck, it doesn't matter what color, um, just comment below and say, hey, I do the same thing. I'd love to read your comments. Hi. Um, so moving on to home goods. I couldn't find too many things at home goods because I kept getting pushed out of the aisles. I do apologize, my little one year old's trying to be a mini me right now. So she's carrying around that little, um, Hello fall sign that I just showed you guys, but um, she's cracking me up. But <laughs> moving on to home goods, didn't find too many things because I kept getting pushed out of the aisles and it just was driving me crazy. So I'll have to go back to home goods if I want, to, if I see any spots in my house that I really want to decorate, then we'll go back to home goods because I found some cute things there. I just kept getting pushed out of the aisle, out of the aisles, and I just, I just wasn't in the mood to get constantly pushed so I just kind of went in and out pretty fast um, but what I did find was this cute um, coffee mug and it says blessed I thought that was super cute and it's very farmhousey looking I just thought it was adorable and I 
love the pumpkin. It just screams fall to me. So, I love that, and it was only $3.99. So, I thought that was a really good deal. The next thing I found, I believe, was these little tiny sunflowers, and they were $3.99 or $4.99 as well at Home Goods. And I just love the galvanized. I'm very farmhousey, and I love the sunflowers. I'm into sunflowers this year. Sunflowers and daisies. Daisies were my summer, my spring, so I'm moving into the sunflowers instead of daisies now. And I just think it's a really good transition from summer into fall, and I just thought it was super cute. And then, and then my husband, um, we also watch Paige Danielle here on YouTube. So if you don't follow her, go follow her. She is about to have her first baby in October, so I'm super excited for her. So is my one year old. You page, um, but she showed this on her um, home goods video the other day, and my husband remembered. And it smells amazing. It's called White Pumpkin, it's from DW Home, and we have already burnt it. Oh, hang on, we've already burnt it because we love the smell, and I believe it's only $7.99. Hang on, does it smell good? Yeah, so good. It smells so good. Oh, <laughs> she loves this smell. I love this smell. My husband loved the smell. And I just thought it was a really, really cute candle and only $7.99. Moving on to the last thing. Moving on to the last thing from Home Goods. Okay, the last thing that I found at Home Goods was this gorgeous. Do you see this, guys? Gorgeous, gorgeous pumpkin. Now, yes, it is ceramic, but it looks woven like together and I just love that texture on my decor and this is actually the first piece that I found for it <laughs> don't eat it thank you I'm trying to eat the flowers but um I just found this and I think Paige did show this in her haul as well um so I'll probably link her haul at the end if I can but um not to get y'all to subscribe to me no, no no I just love her and I want you to go subscribe to her um, because I love this pumpkin and it was super cute and only $14.99 $14.99 see it doesn't take $50 $60 pieces in your house to make your house look nice this is gorgeous and it was only $14.99 so I thought that was a super duper good find and I just love it moving on to Moving on to Walmart now. Moving on to Walmart. Now I found a ton at Walmart. So again, you do not have to spend a lot of money. This is the budget friendly fall haul. Um, this thank you sign, well not thank you, but this give thanks to the Lord sign was only $244 or yeah, $244. And I just thought it was super cute. Still farmhousey, still has my sunflowers super cute, super glittery, um, and I just love it. I thought it was super adorable for the house. The next thing I found um, was this blessing sign. I love the wire, I love the little bow on it. This too was only $2.44. Um, so I thought that was gorgeous too, and on a good, really good budget friendly. And then this pumpkin, I love the cream color and I love how it says give thanks to the Lord for he is good because all good things come from the Lord. Um, and it was only $5.24 if you can see that. And then the last sign, yes, last sign that I, set, I found was this green pumpkin, wooden pumpkin. And I love the galvanized on it. I thought it was super cute. This is Fall Blessing. Got the burlap little bow. I thought it was adorable. And it too was only $5.97. Good, good, good find. The last three pieces that I found was this adorable pumpkin. And it had the sunflower on top. It had the little berries and the leaves. And it was only uh, $4.98. If you can read that, I'm not sure but it was only $4.98, and I just thought it was gorgeous, and it matched perfectly with the house decor. The next piece is this glass jar with the little um, rope on the top of the jar, 
And then all the flowers, there's some dark orange ones, and then there's sunflowers ones, and then there's the white ones. And I just thought it was super cute, not white, cream. And I just thought it was adorable, and I just thought it would go really well with our house decor for this fall season. Now the last, but not least, thing I'm going to show you. Alrighty, the last thing I'm going to show you guys is this awesome bouquet that I made myself. And when I say I made it myself, this obviously I found for probably $8. And then the rest I found in different bouquets at the floral part of the Walmart. And I just put it all together myself. I love this, um, I think they call it elephant's ears. I'm not sure. Um, probably saying that wrong. As immature as I probably am about floral decor. Um, but I just love the cotton. Love the glitter and obviously my little one-year-old agrees and I just love how it's in this milk jug type um, farmers market little thing just adorable so I made this myself and obviously not obviously but I'm, I'm pretty sure it was probably 15 maybe $20 at max to make this bouquet for my centerpiece of my dining room so again, it does not have to cost a lot of money to make your house look gorgeous this fall season. If you have any tips, tricks, or any comments that you'd love to leave me, just leave them below. If you have any stores that you want me to shop at, also leave them below. If you just want to say hi, leave that below. I love you guys. I do, do, do. Really, really love Stay you guys. Stay tuned for more fall videos, fall decor videos. I love you guys. Love and God bless.